Welcome back everyone to Final Fantasy 3. I'm gonna try a little bit of a different setup again. Maybe this will make a little bit more sound every now and then because my arm uh, touches the desk. Um, and maybe that makes some sound every now and then when I move it. Um, maybe it makes less sound. Let's just look at my team level 17 overall. Everyone has got some new equipment, or at least I think everyone. These guys have the lightning and the fire stuff and fire and ice. So both of them have fire and a different element for both of them. Uh, I'm sold a lot of stuff, so that's why I'm not like level 25. But let's just get over with this. I shouldn't speed up anymore. Like you can see, my HP is pretty high. I'm just gonna physical attack with everyone because I want to show you how much that actually matters with these staffs. 411, and please, okay, Lunette doesn't get to attack, but Lunette does like 550 to 600, so it's not that much less anymore. That being said, I think that has to do with the elemental thing as well. Uh, by the way, I don't think if you're on a Chocobo, you will uh, get random encounters. So let's do that. Because I don't really feel like r having random encounters, honestly. I had to be in the desert here, if I remember correctly. But honestly, I can't find where I have to be. You see, I mean, they told me to go to the desert. But there's nothing here. At least I don't think there is. No. That's just a glitchy pixel. So, let's go back into town. Oh yeah. Dismount. And let's go back into town. What do you have to say? But please, I back you. Don't, don't not kill me. I didn't want to kill you, but I won't. No, go away. I have nothing you want. Well... That doesn't help me. There be a demon in the sands to the west. I've seen it. A tree. A giant tree that moves. Oh, that's a tree. That ain't a tree. That's a tornado. You want to know about crystals? Maybe someone in the village of the ancients to the west. Uh... Okay. Far to the west, across the desert, is a village. A village of people who claim to be descendants of ancients. Okay, so they know something I have to know, probably. So let's go back to the village of the ancients and talk to them. That is not a tree. I, I'm just saying that that's not a tree. That's, I don't know what it's supposed to be. But if it's supposed to be a tree, you just failed. That's a major fail. Uh, I want to say Game Freak. I've been playing, not playing, but I've been making a script for a Pokemon video, which is gonna be released like as soon as possible, uh, which is a countdown video. That's the only thing I script, so obviously. Um, oh, you can see the difference now between a physical attack from a mage and from Lunette. So yeah, countdown video. I'm not gonna say just yet what this. You see, it's not that much less. I mean, it's like double, <laughs> double the attack. So yeah, but at least they can attack now, and I, that means in dungeons I can save their, uh, well, not really mana. Yeah, I'm just gonna call it mana uh, for boss fights, which is quite useful. <laughs> I wanna say quite useful. I mean like really. I don't think... am I... no. Oh, I do have a map on the top screen, which is bottom right for you guys. Why didn't I look at it? I don't know. I have to really be careful with not hitting the, the microphone, but that's the thing. Uh, with having uh, to make sounds, that it is. That's the thing with having the keyboard close to the microphone. I don't have my arms on my desk. Which is, well, kind of better for my arms. <laughs> and the fact that I don't have to 
uh, touch the desk that much, which would give vibrations to the microphone, and I don't have a shock mount, so yeah. But then again, it's closer to, to the microphone like that, and that makes a hell of a lot of sounds. So I will probably see what to do. Next episode's gonna be uh, just like normal again. Maybe even this episode. You know, guys, you know what? Screw it, I'm just gonna play like this. I'll just... Uh, hopefully... <laughs> hopefully I'm just gonna shut up for a moment to get a noise profile with me touching um, the keys. So, that I can actually... I mean, that I'll do that next episode, really. Because I don't know where in the audio clip this will be. Um... We are the sons and daughters of ancients, a once great civilization, the first civilization. <laughs> but now we live uh, by land, as our rule commands. Long ago, our rule also charged us with guarding the Tower of Owen. Okay, where's that whole Tower of Owen of yours? Would you believe me if I told you that the ground was standing on? This continent was a love Rubbish, you say? Well, it's nonetheless, uh, Tower of Owen is a pillar, the pillar that supports our continent built by the ancients to bring balance between light and darkness. Okay. Our ancestors uh, once built a great civilization, but were punished for their arrogance. That is the, uh, the red of light, the attempt to la 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 la. It's a long dialogue, and I haven't really read it all that much. I'm just gonna walk around this village talking to people in this episode. Light and darkness have their own will. A will that transcends a mortal blah blah blah. Crystal exists, bring balance to forces. When the balance tilts too far, the crystals um, choose four mortals, bless them with their power. Now the balance is still the darkness for warriors of light will be chosen, the task, blah blah blah. Yeah, that's us. But we have to find that crystal of yours. This guy is like, way off here, but it's a child, it seems like. I'll give you a prize if you uh, run around the edge of the continent on a chocobo. Um, okay. It looks like that's actually possible. I might be interested in doing that. I mean, I'll, I'll probably speed it up, but Chocobos eliminates random encounters and doesn't seem like it's impossible or anything. If you look at the map, it seems fairly easy, even. So let's do that! Okay! I mean, I don't know how they track stuff like this. It's really weird sometimes how they track stuff. But it's far from impossible. It's quite easy, even. And it's relaxing. Just, how is, she, how is you guys? How are you guys doing? How is you guys doing? Wow, my, my English! Wow. Derps up sometimes. Okay, there's a sound right over here. Gotta remember that. I mean, you get to explore the continent and enjoy it and stuff, and there's a cave over there. You get to know a lot of things you didn't know before. You're not going to tell me I can't go... Oh, okay, I can. Good. Please dismount. Okay. That's the entire continent done. I won my prize now. If you're not gonna give me a prize now and just, like, troll a lo I'm gonna kill you. But I don't think I can do that in this game. <laughs> you actually did it! Yes, I did. I didn't speed it up, though. Well, good work. I mean, work. Here's a prize. Gnomish... Brett? What? Uh, what's that? This plays a detailed map. I uh, searched so like sides, but it's an uh, item. Well, 
that's useful, I think. Uh, use this then for training. So, that was a waste of our time. Do you have anything to say? Oh no, you are no, you are you are the multiplayer guy and I don't have friends. Forgot about that. I don't have any friends. <laughs> Not at all. I haven't talked to you yet. Are rule commands us? Oh yeah, I have. So, you're the last guy in here that's not old, so... Have you ever seen a chocobo? Yeah. Such strange bird it is. Uh, yeah, woods to the east. So no one's gonna tell me anything. I mean, they are, but I don't really feel like reading all of that. Our ancestors built a great civilization, we were punished for our blah blah blah, red of light. The attempts to, uh, power of light... Could not... Four warriors in the world darkness stop destructive force of light. Well, that's another take on the story. <laughs> the the four warriors of darkness. I would like to make a game about that. Our oh, answer uh, But now the darkness is emerged, will bring chaos and destruction in its wake. All that we can do is wait for the warriors to appear once again. Well, here I fucking am. And yet you're not helping me. Would you believe me if I said I uh, was standing on this continent? What, uh, yeah, rubbish, you say. Well, nonetheless, true. The Tower of Owen is a pillar, a pillar that supports our continent, built by the ancestors to bring balance between light and darkness. I haven't visited this house yet, I think. Oh, just kidding, I have. Well, no one's actually willing to help me. I have talked to you, haven't I? Uh, yeah. Okay. So, no one is actually going to help me with doing this. Uh, Chocobo. Chocobo, Chocobo, Chocobo. One, they are faster. Two, I don't have any random encounters while riding a Chocobo, which is pretty cool. So, yeah. Let me... I mean, I have looked up a walkthrough for like, only for getting into the right direction. Yeah, I've talked to you two guys, you're not providing any information whatsoever. Um, oh, wait, wait, wait. There's a settlement in the mountains west of uh, Castle, it said people who can see into the future. Well, let's go there. I want to go to that future side place and obviously after a second we get a random encounter and fishes killer fish let's steal something from these killer fish if they have something that is and that did do quite a lot of damage like we are used to I like doing a lot of damage obtain a potion why does that fish have a potion we will probably never know I mean, I'm doing like less than half, actually. I'm still doing a lot with my mages. It's physical attacking, guys. Don't even bother arguing with that. Oh, these boats are so slow. Well, let's firstly go into the castle to see whether or not they are back at home. Doesn't seem like they are. There are no guards around just yet. No, they are not. Okay, let's go back. To the west of here is some place where there are like people that can see into the future, and I would like them to do that. I don't believe you, so show me. No? Okay. Good. Uh, where am I supposed to go after this random battle, that is? And two goblets. Or knockers. Same basic ID. Um, yeah, that should, that should be enough. Steal, steal something good, please. I failed to steal anything. You horrible, horrible thief. And I didn't want that to happen because he's not gonna kill me in one hit. No. That's what you get for not killing him, killing him, killing him, killing him in one hit. Uh, yet another try, I suppose. Steal. 
I stole a potion this time. And 130. Which gives me... Yeah, you get like 100 to 200 gil for a battle. So it has been... What am I seeing in the water there? Nothing good. I mean, I suppose. Why, hello. Who are you? You are Glugan Glock. We Glugans were born sightless. However, we endowed with power of clear... Uh, we can glimpse into the future. Well, that's very nice. The crystal that gave you a blessing is the crystal of wind. We must go and seek... Oh, you must go and seek... Yeah, that's we, so we must go and seek... The other three, the crystals of fire, water, and earth. If you tell me where they are, I would be glad to. I'm not going to talk to all of you guys. There are stairs down here. So, <laughs> just going to take that. Oh, more of you guys. I'm just not going to talk to you. How about that? Ooh! 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 Treasure! Fire staff. I didn't have to buy that fucking staff! I st You're kidding me, right? Oh, mage rope. Oh, oh yeah, I bought that as well. I could have saved like 10,000 gil on just... Ugh, I hate you. I hate you, game. The middle one. You see, the middle one is always the leader. Use this spell to enter the Tower of Owen to the north. Desh, your destiny awaits. We got Toad. Okay, so I get we have to be mini in order to get to a gnome village, but why in the fucking world would we have to be totes to enter a tower? I suppose we'll find out. The tower is of o 